Now, Preston, on the other hand, um, on his cheat sheet that he always has to give me, because he's been with me now for doing this. How many years have you been on the air with me? A long time. Um, I, 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 I had solid black hair back before we started, but now yeah. it's, it's half and half. It's right. salt and pepper now. <laughs> now, if you all had a camera in here, which Preston does, and you understood where what what uh, Preston is actually wearing as he talks about salt and pepper, <laughs> he has a, a Snoopy t-shirt on and polka dotted pants. So start that out. So as you listen to him, he's a big, strong, handsome guy, and he is has a Snoopy shirt on. So, just so you know. So, he's been with me a really long time. He's going to talk about some household maintenance things. I know last week when we were on the air together, you shared some great hacks. And it wasn't like Russian hacks. It was more like <laughs> hacks about how you can do some neat things for your home. Just a reminder, though, before we start in the first segment, I'd like to go over those hacks again. Oh, absolutely. Quickly. Is that all right? Because they were such good pieces of information, especially the one about the toilet, not to have another show about toilets. <laughs> that one was good. But that toilet. was really, really good. Well, so, you, oh, sure. Um, and, uh, but, but I also, too, before we do that, just real quick, I want to also introduce Sandy, Sandy Dickinson um, with Summit Funding. Sandy is one of the top mortgage brokers in Charlotte and has great information to provide and insight about how to sell your home and using the mortgage as not just a means to get the home, but a way to help you to continue to build wealth and a way to help you plan your financial future. Is that a fair statement? Yep, that's a fair statement. Okay. Well, she didn't pay you to say that, <laughs> just so you know. And Sandy, you're going to talk about things with rates and also some different programs and how they may change in 2017, right? right. right? Mm -hmm. That's perfect. All right, so Preston, you've got the floor. All right. I want to hear those hacks, and then you remember my hack, too. You're welcome to share it as well. Okay, do you want to start with the toilet hack or the dishwasher hack? Let's do the toilet hack. <laughs> the toilet Let's get that hack. out of the way so Let's people can move on with their appetite for the rest of the day. Let's start with the toilet. Okay. Well, um, <laughs> we, we started in the toilet. <laughs> there we go. We're off to a great start. Um, well, you know, water leaks, uh, if you have a water leak in your house, and we talked about, you know, if your water bill is spiked up or your meter's running when everything's off, the usual couplet is a running toilet. And sometimes you hear it, but sometimes you don't. And one way that the, the plumbing hack is to find out if you have a, a, a leaky toilet is to put food coloring in the, you know, lift the lid off the water closet, put about 15 drops of food coloring in there on each of your toilets and by the time you get done with the last one go back to the first one and see if there's any color in the bowl the bowl itself should be clear but if there's any color in the bowl then you have a leak and more than likely it's a flapper issue so you gotta work on that flapper absolutely yeah, that's All a right. good one that is a good one and then the tang one the tang one um if your dishwasher is just not quite doing the job you you, you wash your dishes and you still got it's just a little cloudy or a little grimy what happens is you get a calcium buildup, and especially if you're on a well, uh, like Paul. So uh, a plumbing hack for that is tang. Uh, tang, the citrus and the tang will clean your dishwasher, which will in turn make your dishes cleaner. So what you want to do is, um, if you're getting ready, uh, you have your dishwasher there, run the sink with hot water until, you know, at first it's cold, run it until it turns hot, you know, you're priming the pipes. Then turn the dishwasher on for about five minutes till water gets in the bottom of the dishwasher. Then put 10 ounces of Tang in there and run the entire cycle. And, uh, you know, barring anything else being wrong with your dishwasher, your dishes will be uh, sparkling, crystally clean afterwards. Nice. All right. And the last one, feel free to share my, my one and only hack. I'll start you off, but you finish it. It had to do with Pam. I know that, and okay. it loosened up. But you, you go ahead. Okay, so if you've got soap scum on your shower, and right. you just... You know that grungy soap scum you just can't seem to get off and those little brushy guys on the commercial aren't <laughs> doing it for you? Spray Pam cooking spray on that grunge on your shower glass. Let it sit for a few minutes and then wipe it completely clean. Hence, removal of soap scum. Wow. Nice. So, Pam is on the list uh, next time we go to the grocery store. Yeah. I don't Pam know about the tank. other generic brands. The the brands. Yeah. I don't know about the generic brands. I don't know if Stan or any of the other ones work, but Pam, they say on the list, does work. So right. we'll go Great with that. Great value from we'll Sam's.